Let's see if this is stable. Theoretically, this is streaming at 4K60. I don't know how my computer's going to feel about that. Yeah, let me see. Hello, Internet. Is the stream working? Uh. I'm trying to get this to stream on Mixer also. You wouldn't be able to see it. Oh, that chat is super duper tiny, isn't it? Oh man, can you even... That's completely illegible, isn't it? If I, like, blow it up, you can read it. But then you can't read anything else. Huh. Well, the left side of the screen is not that important anyway. Sorry, I don't know that one. Excuse me, Google. I didn't ask your opinion here. Anyway, I've been wanting to make a video about the YouTube plays, mixer plays, whatever you want to call it, for a while now. Can I make it? Oh yeah, now it's now it doesn't fit on the screen anymore. Uh. Uh, is that legible? Oh yeah, I guess... I guess if I just made it big and made it small, then like, who cares? Okay. Cause see, I've got this fancy wide monitor, but YouTube doesn't support that resolution on live streams, at least last time I checked. It does on videos, but not on live streams. So I've got all this extra screen real estate, this stream real estate to do. I don't know what with. Oh. Oh, let the stream type the script. I didn't even think of that idea. That's a terrible idea. And it's not going to happen. But, you know. Thanks, Twitter, for your suggestion. What if I make this? Don't, don't make me write code. I'm not here to write code. I'm barely motivated enough to write words into a Word document. I've, I've been... Just thinking about doing this, not to mention the other project I've been thinking about doing for like weeks, basically ever since the stream ended, but uh, I haven't found the motivation to. So I figured, ugh, fine, if I put up a stream and I can have 40 people in a chat yelling at me, and then maybe that will give me motivation to write the script, because this is kind of the worst part, to be honest. Like, ah, uh, here. Let me... Uh-oh. Didn't want that to be... Oh, I don't know. If I, I didn't think this through. You're gonna see everything on my computer. Oh, God. I don't know what's worse, seeing my school paper file names, or seeing my folder structure on my Dropbox. Uh... <laughs> oh... I don't even know where I put it. Where did I put it? Ah. Uh, here. So yeah, the the very first thing I did, so for the for the jump rope video, I just sort of winged it. Like I I opened audition and I just kind of started recording. And, you know, that was fun, but it ended up, ended up being, like, kind of unstructured. And, you know, if I wanted to, go, like, go back and insert a line, you know, that, that gets annoying. 
Um, let's see, will it let me do this? You shut up. Sh shut up. You don't care, right? You're still gonna let me work, right? Uh, what's this called? Uh, YouTube plays. Oh no, uh, it's gonna be annoying because I'm using this mic in two different things. Oh wait, here we go. Hello, does it work? Hello, does it work? It works. Hello. Oh no, don't do that. Work? So that's what I did for the um, the uh, jump rope video. Just sort of went in, recorded with you know very little thought, very little you know very little potential for editing. So it was just you know one big long audio file, and I just like trimmed out the silences. Does it work? Hello. Does it work? Which you know is maybe not the most natural way of talking, but that seems to be the standard for like vlogs and stuff. So why don't we just get rid of all the silence? Then it just sounds dumb. Hello. Does it work? Yeah, it sounds dumb. Anyway, so then for the ball, the the volleyball video, I figured okay, I'll write a script first. That'll That'll let me be slightly more structured about it and like know everything I'm gonna say. And I ended up, like, cause you know, I, I put captions on these videos. So I ended up typing out the entire script of the uh, jump rope video regardless. So I figured, okay, if I do that first, that's a slightly more structured workflow that I can use to actually make a thing. Um, but then that ended up being 2000 words which, you know, that's not unreasonably long, but it just makes me feel like I'm in school again writing papers, and I'd prefer to not feel that way ever again. But honestly, it is helpful to write a script first. Like, there's a reason people do that. So then, for this thing, even more complicated, I figured, okay, a smart thing to do is probably to write an outline, and then from the outline, write a script. That's smart. So I made, I made this rough outline, and I was like, okay, that's, that's enough work for one day. And then I basically never got back up, got back to it. And so I wrote this, like, barely a sentence thing. And that's basically all I've gotten done for this video project. Or for the other coding project I wanted to work on. I at least wrote, like, two lines of code or something. Uh, did you... I, th I thought YouTube would, like, automatically tweet about the stream. But I don't think it did. So... Let me tweet. Come motivate me. Mo words are hard. Motivate me. Tweet. Wow. I am an expert Twitterer. Yeah, this this tweet. Oh jeez. This tweet is pretty accurate. As you can see. Uh, where do I get that? So, yeah. That, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna write and you guys are gonna yell at me when I'm not writing. And hopefully I'll have at least like half of her script done. Or something. So yeah, I figured... The introduction, everyone knows what Twitch Plays Pokemon is, so anyone beat my score in the volleyball? Yeah, someone got 99,000. I don't know who. Uh, their name is like Yuzu or something. I can, I can try to figure out. I think they're on the leaderboard already, and like I tried to find them, and I couldn't. Yeah, Yuzu. 
Let's see. Yuzu. Uh, I don't know how to spell Odyssey or volleyball. So, I don't know what I'm going to be able to find. Did they... You know what? Scrolling through a random Twitter search on a live stream could actually end very poorly. So I'm going to maybe not do that. Right, right. I'm not. I'm not <laughs> Thank you. I'm not writing. So I figured for the introduction, everyone knows what Twitch Plays Pokemon is. And if they don't, they can Google it. So I don't need to say much about what this stream was and how it worked. I, I left in some blanks because I don't remember how long this was or when it started. Oops. So then I want to like transition to just starting so I, I feel like I want like a title screen of sorts in between and have like I, I want it to be like this is the chronicle of YouTube plays Super Mario Odyssey. Where'd you learn to code Python? High school. Oh, the shop moon? Which shop moon? In Tostarena? I don't remember everything from this stream, I'm sorry to say. But I wrote down what I think are the important, interesting parts. Every shop moon. Uh, I don't know. I kind of just want to talk about, like, this. Oh, that, the one behind the shop. Yeah. And I'm also, I, I use the word so too much. I was thinking, like, so then. So then. But so is just like such a cheap transition word. Doesn't even necessarily always make sense. And I want yeah, I want to have like a title screen, and you know I I'm not a graphic designer, but someone made that uh, uh b -b 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 ah wrong screen ah wrong screen. There we go. Uh, someone made that like Discord uh thingy. What what have you called that logo, channel, server, icon? I don't even know how to find it. Uh, it's probably in downloads. Kind picture. It's the thumbnail to this live stream. If YouTube ever updates. Uh this thing. This thing. This thing. Oh. Oh, Windows, Windows 10, please, please don't do this. Come on, open. Come on. Oh my god, Windows. 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 Okay, whatever, you saw it. <laughs> what happened to writing? Right. Uh... Hold on, this is, why does this keep getting set to top chat? I don't want it to filter spam. Like, why would it, f why would it filter spam from me when I'm the sole moderator in this chat room? Like, that's, I don't know if you guys noticed, but YouTube added this little drop down so you can view either top chat or live chat. And like, presumably it's trying to filter spam or something, but I'm the moderator of this chat room. I should be able to see the spam and the racist people, so I can then ban them. Like, it shouldn't try to hide that thing, hide that stuff from me. Like, there's this separate option for, well, I guess I can't see it there, but for filtering spam, like, entirely. Anyway, whatever. YouTube, YouTube chat is a bad platform, but that's where my subscribers are, so that's why I'm, that's where I'm streaming. 
Yeah, this, this, is, this would be like an awkward transition. So basically I had the idea to do that, but with Mario instead of Pokemon, using code from my Mario bots. Oh, that, that's a really awkward, I did not think this sentence through. Let's, let's, let's read this from the top. No, fucking ending. Everyone knows Twitch plays Pokemon, right? Some guy wired up a Twitch chat, so their commands became inputs to Pokemon Red. Ah, uh, that's, that's, since sometimes you can, like, write something, and it, it, like, flows, like, as you're writing it, but then you, like, go back and actually try to read it, and it's like, no, that's not a sentence a human would ever say. Uh... What if I should try to make it? Imagine Twitch plays Pokemon, but instead of Twitch, it's YouTube, and instead of Pokemon, it's Super Mario Odyssey. I feel like I'm I'm trying to live up to some stupid standard that I've set for myself. Oh, I've, how many subscribers do I have? Ooh, 18,695. That's a big number. I really like it when the number goes up. That was the idea I had back in January. In my awards, I back in. Uh, <laughs> intros are always the hardest part. So, what if we just forget about the intro for now? She lost it. I don't even want to mention the time, because I, I launched it at 12.30 a.m., which is a bad time to start a live stream. Stream launched at 12:30 a.m. on January 15th on 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 Thursday. I don't know when. When did I do this? When did this happen? How do I even find out? Twitter? Did I tweet about it? <laughs> now free from down ball hell. Uh, when did the stream start? Uh, January 5th? Yeah, I guess, shit, like... Cause, yeah, it was past midnight. When was January 5th? Friday. I guess it was technically Friday. January 5th. Stream launched at 12.30 a.m. on Friday, January 5th, and, well, it was kind of abject chaos. Uh, as you might imagine, Twelve thirty AM on Friday, January fifth, and well it was kind of epic chaos as you might imagine. I guess my outline wasn't very I wanted to have like a what if instead of well it was a beat and 
It was kind of abject chaos, as you might imagine. The stream launched at 12.30 a.m. on Friday, January 5th, and it was kind of abject chaos, as you might imagine. <laughs> nah, if I'm gonna have the beat, I don't want as you might imagine. It was kind of abject chaos. And then I could have, as you might imagine, in the next sentence, as you might imagine, Mario... Okay. Yeah. Sure. I will stick what I have in a Google Doc. And you all can edit it alongside me. Whack. Mm. Actually, I was going to do that as a joke, but come to think of it, Google Docs doesn't like allow people to make suggestions. So maybe that's not such a terrible idea. Let's see. Uh, YouTube plays scripts. I'm not going to put the timeline. Everyone knows it's in the best timeline. Anyone with the link can comment? I don't necessarily know what that looks like. So here... Let's see what that looks like with a bunch of people all trying to comment. I don't know what comments look like. Does that link work? God friggity frackle. It worked for some people. Some people are here. Ugh. Some people... Some people are here. What if I do that? Does that work? Okay, that link should work. Because, yeah, YouTube chat still does that weird thing where it breaks links for no good reason. Oh my. Oh, I really hope people can't post images. Let me make sure they can't. very quickly, please. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, this is going bye-bye. If people can submit images, that... that will end... that will end poorly. I'll leave it up on the other screen. Or like, hmm, I wonder if I can have it open without the comments and then just have the comments not on screen. Uh, view? Can I just not show the comments? Oh boy. Oh, oh my. Oh. Oh no. Oh. Oh my. Okay, this was a mistake. Even even if you can't actually edit, this is a hundred five pages. How is this? Okay, this is not productive. This is not productive. Let's go back to this. Ah, uh, Mario just sort of. What's like am ambles? Is that a word? I feel like I shouldn't. No. That's 
walk. I mean, it's it's a drunkard's walk. Like, this is the mathematical concept. <laughs> Underlying. Yeah, amples is a word, but it's not the word I'm looking for. Well, maybe it is. I mean, he wasn't. It's not like he was walking quickly. Sort of ambles around randomly with little sense of purpose. One aspect of the list of buttons the chat had access to, I decided to throw in the capture button just for funsies. It was meant to be a hidden easter egg. Of, you capitalize easter egg, right? Whatever, it doesn't matter. This is my script. But it didn't take long for literally everyone to find out about it. Oh wait, did the did it crash? That's pretty funny. Uh Oh god. Google Drive, I have too many files. Hi man, get rid of this please. How many pages is it now? It's fewer pages now. I don't know how that works. This is legit killing everyone. Oh my. Hi. I can't even read this. Oh god, this font. What is this? I'm not putting this on the screen because I don't, I don't know what images people have... Oh no, it, it, the pages are still loading. There are, in fact, more pages than what it initially presents. Oh my, uh, uh, that's distracting. It didn't take long for literally everyone to find out about it. Still though, of the list of buttons, what, what, no, incorrect, I mean that's barely a sentence anyway, but, you know, I, I feel like this, of the list of, of the list of buttons the chat had access to. I mean, that, that's not, like, really grammatically correct, to be fair, but I feel like that's still something I would say, which is kind of meant to be the point of this. Oh, yeah, don't... Don't open that on your phone. That'll end poorly for your poor phone. <laughs> Whatever, I'll... No, because I feel like if I leave it in the script, then I'm going to say it. So, like, it, it should be something reasonable. The stream launched at 12.30 a.m. on Friday, January 5th. And it was... It was abject chaos. As you might imagine, Mario just sort of... I'm talking in the present tense here. Decided to... 
give the chat access to the capture button. There we go. That's that's a better sentence. So you might imagine Mario just sort of ambled around aimless randomly with little sense of purpose. While the camera seems to have a mind of its own. Yeah, I feel like that should have two clauses or whatever. Yeah, let's make this chat bigger so I can actually look at it. I don't need this outline just yet. I don't want to talk about like every little minutia of how this thing worked. Like I don't want to talk about the camera controls unless it's relevant or the vote banning system or like the cooldowns or anything like that. Like I, I just want to talk about the like super high level big moments. Someone copied the Someone copied the B movie script into the Google Doc. That's unfortunate. Okay, stream launched twelve thirty a.m. on f the stream launched at twelve thirty. Actually, every time I want to read, it, I have to like make sure I'm actually doing it in like this narration voice, which is not a particularly natural way of talking. Blech, 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 blech. Also, I decided to give the chat access to the capture button, just for funsies. It was meant to be a hidden easter egg of sorts, but it didn't take long for literally everyone to find out about it. Still though, the chat... The chat... Uh, still the chat persisted and before long found them s I don't know persisted that's that's a weird I don't know what persevered persevered that's that's what I'm trying to persevere persevered yeah and for long found themselves face to face with their first major obstacle what is it actually I just called it frog tower what's it actually called Top Hat Tower. Okay. Scaling Top Hat Tower. Forty nine. <laughs> Uh, there. Cool. Capture a frog and use it to reach the, the tower by navigating a series of platforms. Although it was certainly difficult for them to aim themselves, like I, I want to use some kind of like weird, like subversion of language here, to like highlight the fact that you know they're not moving in the traditional sense of how you move in a video game. But uh, I don't know. It was certainly difficult for them to aim themselves in any particular uh, direction. The tower itself wasn't part 
wasn't me, wasn't particularly treach. Great, everyone's gonna know how good I am at spelling. Treacherous. No, that's not even remotely close. Treach. Oh, there's no T. Why would there be? Obviously, there's no T. Although it was certainly difficult for them to direct themselves. Why are there 11? Are there 11? God, I'm gonna keep getting distracted. I don't even have the thing open anymore. I just keep... People keep mentioning it. Oh my. Uh, okay. Oh, my, oh wow, it is 1100 pages. Oh. It's 1183 pages long. Oh. Okay, I'm going to close that again. And in fact, I think. Oh, whoops! I still have the du the transition duration set stupidly high. No, 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 no! Come back. Uh, I'm. Hold on. Let's go into. I need to make a new scene. Uh, just a second. Oh, whoops. Do 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 font size super big because it's 4K. Okay. I'm back. Okay. Uh, the, pat the tower itself wasn't particularly treacherous. And within a couple of hours, pretty quick by Twitch plays. Okay. Nope, nope. <laughs> Pokemon standards. If you ask me, if I manage to reach the top, fortunately, assist mode helped. Er, not even helped, prevented them from undoing all of their progress by progress no, by just going off the tower uh, it was like two hours right I guess I have to actually bug check a folder though with all those or I could just watch them on YouTube actually YouTube probably loads faster than VLC 
No, not that. That. Oh, wait, hold on. I probably don't want to show that. Whoop. Okay, I stand corrected about YouTube loading quickly. From the next bus. Okay, so yeah, it was two hours, like, total for them. Well, okay, so they climbed the tower in an hour and a half, and then they beat the boss in the next 30 minutes. Okay, cool. And within an hour and a half. Did this font like change? Oh, why did the font change? Oh, because I added the accented E? Seriously? Word. Come on. Work with me here. Be reasonable. Don't just change to a completely different font family because I throw in an accented... Actually, no, I think it was because I threw in the... Smiley face by accent. Yeah, that's, that's what does it. It was the smiley face. No, I'm not going to mention the two-player run. That'll be our secret... It is, however, archived on YouTube if you would like to watch it. Sorry, was that loud? And as for the boss... Well... Again, it was a case of an obstacle not really posing much of a threat. No, that's not what that word says. No, still, no. there we go. Not really posing much of a threat. Uh, and another half hour later. Uh, what's his name? Uh, the Brutals. Topper? Is that the right? Yeah. Topper. Was dispatched. Boom. As for the boss, well, okay. Some people thought it would be, yeah, because I remember there, there were some people like, ah, you're never going to beat the boss. Some people thought it would be impossible, but once again, it was a case of an obstacle not really posing much of a threat, and another half an hour later, Topper was dispatched. Can I take you on a date to Arby's? Yeah, sure. Arby's is cool. You're paying, right? Uh, at this point, Although the chat 
didn't really know what it was doing. With two, I, I already said I wasn't going to indent, but now I'm indenting. Nah. It's a side effect of using Word. I've got my ways of paying. Oh no. Oh no. How's the Discord doing? I still leave you guys open. I know there's nothing inappropriate in here. Oh, but that's going to be kind of illegible, isn't it? Oh well. You're already well. <laughs> I, I guess I could link to the Discord in case there's anyone in this stream who's oops boop who's not uh in the Discord. There's a link to the Discord. It's unofficial as you can see. Unofficial. Okay. Blah. I had soda in a while. Although, uh, the, the chat didn't really know what it was doing. So, yeah, um, I don't know if anyone has noticed, but, uh, if if anyone if anyone and by anyone I mean literally oh god that made that chat big too I didn't want this I don't know if literally everyone has noticed but uh I I was talking a little slow in my volleyball video um and, you know, it was partially because of the excuse I posted, where it was like, eh, you know, some people like it when people After talk. No, 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 you shut up. I was like, yeah, some people like, oh, God, it's using them all the way out. Zoom slightly out. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> I was like, what is that? What? It's expired? Are you sure? I think you're wrong. That's a link that doesn't expire. Uh, but anyway. It was mostly because I had, like... Because I was doing it like this. I was writing the script and then editing the video. And so I didn't necessarily know what the timing of everything would be like. So for, like... Come on. Come on. I guess, control. I guess my internet is not super happy with everything that I'm doing right now. Okay, I guess streaming and watching Forever. YouTube videos at the same In time fact, is I... asking a little too much of fiber. Come on. I should be able to handle this. Come on. Come on. Come on, YouTube. Come on, YouTube. Yeah, this this part. I was like, okay, I want this animation to be kind of slow so it can look look cool. So then how fast do I want to talk? And so I was like, okay, I should probably talk kind of slow. But then that ended up leading to scenarios where I was like talking too slow and then I didn't really have any filler footage to use. Uh, phew. I guess that's why people get paid to do this sort of thing, because it's not exactly that easy to, like, do it well. But I figure if I write this just sort of naturally, uh, I, I'll pretty much have infinite filler footage to use, because, you know, I've got literally nine days continuous video 
to like work with. So like, I feel like I don't have to worry as much about my pace in this one. I can, like if I, if I take too long to say something, I can just, you know, I'll have infinite filler footage to use. And if I say something too quickly, um, I, I can like cut it up maybe, or, or I, can, I can always go back and re-record. But, ugh, ugh. And, like, I, I know that the Creative Clouds Suite, Creatives, that's what CS stands for, right? Creative Suite. The Adobe applications all have nice interplay with each other, and, like, I think you can have an audition multi-track timeline as a... Uh, audio track in Premiere. In fact, why don't why don't I just find out? Wait, hold on. What? No, don't do that. No, 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 no. No, no. Why are you doing that? No, 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 no. No, don't. What? I thought. I thought I had a perpetual license. Because I got this license from the university and I thought it didn't expire. I thought this license didn't expire. Oh no. Oh no. Fuck. How much does Creative Cloud cost? Oh. That sucks. I said a naughty word. Yeah, I'm sorry. Well, crap. Does that just mean I can never close on Because Audition launched. So if, am I just not allowed to close it ever? Or I'll lose access to it? Great. Great. Perfect. Okay. Well, I guess I'm not making this video tonight. I can at least keep working on this script, though. Yeah, I know there are ways to get Creative Cloud for free, but I'm not... I'm not going to do that on stream, <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> Although the chat didn't really know what it was doing, or really how to get anything done. With two objectives, with two success successes two victories that's the word I'm looking for under its belt overall confidence my confidence really everyone made fun of that line I was just trying to make sure I had enough time to play the video uh, Overall confidence was high.
and then I don't want to like say the things people made fun of me for. It's like the but. Uh, like how do I transition to introducing the two D section? Man, that's, I thought I thought it was a perpetual license. Oh, are they yearly license licenses? Was I was I using a yearly license all this time without knowing it? And my year is up. Oh, but that was short lived. That's yeah. I, I feel like that's. But well, I I don't know if that necessarily follows like this sentence, but like directly inverting that saying like. Uh. On I I don't know what transition would be like, but or unfortunately. Definitely not however. However is definitely a word I use too much when I'm writing a paper. But it's, like, however is one of those words that comes up when you're trying to, like, you know, write a paper. And you just need a nice transition word. But, like, when you're actually speaking like a human being, you never, uh, never use the word however. With two victories under its belt, Overall confidence. Overall confidence was high. So that confidence. Uh, I, I, I feel like I need to pat out this sentence a little bit, like add a few more beats. But as it turns out, as it turn turned out, as it turns out, that confidence was a bit misplaced. Like it's it's wordy and it's like a bad sentence. But that's, like, something I would actually say, I think. Because that, that's the thing when you're writing this. Like, I feel like because I'm using Microsoft Word, um, I, I feel like I'm trying to, like, write formal paper sort of thing. Or at least, like, write real sentences. But no, I'm, I'm just trying to tell myself what to say. It's it's more like creating a PowerPoint presentation, in in a sense, because th this is how I would make PowerPoints in school, and I was always pretty good at that. Not to toot my own horn, but like, I would like open PowerPoint, and I would basically just come up with a rough outline of whatever I wanted. And then I would go back, like basically what I have here, like this, this sort of outline, except, you know, in PowerPoint and, you know, I'd think about like, oh, what visuals do I want here? And like what sound, I, I would, I would, I would basically think about like the overall structure and maybe I'd do that in Word or something. And that's, that's like what this is, just like what's the overall structure, the flow of the information. Then usually the second thing I would do when making a presentation like in PowerPoint is I would work on the visuals uh, because that's that's kind of what matters a lot well there's a lot of things that matters but like it, it I don't want to turn this stream into like showing off my presentations but like where's one here let me try and find one God, I, I don't even remember making that. Uh, hold on, it's probably in Google Drive, Comp 585, juiciness, juiciness. Here we go. Whoops. That's, that's not a real slide. So yeah, this was a presentation I made for like my game, video game design class uh, on the topic of juiciness, which is you know, too nebulous of a thing to try to explain right now. 
but like the very first well the very first thing I did was come up with an outline which is like okay I'm gonna introduce juiciness I'm gonna list a bunch of examples and then I'm gonna go into more depth and I probably broke that down in Microsoft Word or something uh, turn down the stream delay I would but my monitor is 1440p and so if I turn down the stream delay I cannot stream at that resolution and so this would all be a blurry mess so that's why yes my yeah um and so then the, the second thing i would do is like think about what the visuals i wanted to be so like th this one i i really like this slide well yeah well, nah, I, I ruined it yeah we start with the title slide i think okay i want these cool pictures of oranges and i want the handwritten juiciness and then the next slide I think okay I found this stock footage on YouTube I want this cool squirt effect and then I'm gonna have and then I'm gonna like punctuate that I'm gonna like punctuate I don't even know what the sentence is going to be but I'm gonna come up with a sentence I'm gonna punctuate it with the word juicy and then I have a bunch of examples and you know just have like footage of those examples and stuff and yeah and then and then I, okay, I'm thinking I'm gonna have this example and it's gonna look like this. And so, and then once I've done that and I have all of the, yeah, once I have my orange motif, then I go back and I use presenter, the presenter view notes thing. And then I just write down the word for word script of exactly what I'm gonna say. And like, I just kind of do it. I just kind of do it can't type that fast no do it without really thinking about proper sentence structure or anything like that you know like I can't type that fast while I'm trying to make an example but you know just, just type the way I think and that works really well for PowerPoint presentations but I don't I, I I've never really made videos structured like this is the thing aside from you know those two videos that i just made so it's kind of awkward to me like writing this script before i have i don't it's confidence was misplaced but as it turns out that confidence was misplaced that mm, I want to have like a snarky tone or something but mm. <sighs> For their first true, so someone in the chat gave this suggestion to like make it to emphasize that this is an actual challenge. Their first true challenge, lie, lie, lie. Okay, this this is an actual grammar thing. What is lie shortly, shortly, lay shortly ahead, right? That's how that sentence is supposed to read, right? That's how the English language works, right? Oh wow, the, the delay actually is higher than I thought it was. Oh well, it's the trade-off for having an actual quality stream. <laughs> Lated. <laughs> yeah, just stick that into the script and don't even say anything about it. Lay shortly ahead. Yeah, so I think then I can go into like, uh, this doesn't have to be a pair, whatever, paragraphs are meaningless. Uh, you see, this 2D section in the Cascade Kingdom seems simple at first
but winding structure. I don't I don't know if winding is the right word. Yeah, maybe maybe I should just do this more like PowerPoint. Just don't even think about it. Just write, and then I can go back and like see if the winding structure of it of it the way Mario has to go left then right then oh actually no he starts right has to go right then left then right right then left means that even though he can't yeah I mean Writing a sentence like this with like 5,000 commas in it is normally a bad idea, but I feel like in this uh, this particular context, again, because this this is me talking, it's meant to like sound like an actual like a like a, like a run-on sentence, but slightly more structured, but like mm, that, that's that's why writing this in Word is kind of weird to me, and you know I I could just use not Word, but you know Word has nice autocorrect and stuff. Way Mario has to go right, then left, then right, then left. That means means that even though he can't even even thought I always do that. Even though he can't really die here. If he ever mistimes a jump, he can find himself Uh, losing progress. Yeah, I, going back down a level. Yeah, I, I I need to stop getting so worked up on making these like tight tight ass sentences. Like this is a paper, and just like if if I say the same thing twice in in two different ways, like sure, that's the way people talk. Like the the whole point of writing is the point of writing a script isn't to make this like oh I'm writing an essay and then I'm gonna read it to you because that's boring. It's to make it's to I don't know why am I writing a script. It's it's so I can organize my thoughts. It's so like if I decide to go back and interject a thought earlier, then boom, you have zero bytes left on your C drive. I feel your pain. I feel your pain. To be fair, a good chunk of this hard drive is YouTube Plays archives. I could delete a lot of them. And maybe I will after I make this video. But, uh, yeah. Need more hard drives. And if he does, and if he misses multiple in a row. Well, no, it's, it's not even that. Well, okay. If he misses multiple jumps in a row, as YouTube is wont to do, he can find himself falling even further down All of this is exacerbated by the fact that the chat is operating on a not insignificant delay, even on the ultra low latency setting, YouTube streaming introduces a good few seconds of delay which means the chats a good intentioned attempts to put Mario I'm gonna have to like find an example of this, or maybe I could just not and pretend. Hopefully, people will understand me. Put Mario back on track by reversing his direction. Can in fact uh, 
uh, send him flying uh, to him in fact just launch him now and in fact lead to him can in fact do the exact opposite there When did Mixer happen? See, that first video was 12 hours. This is one hour. This is all okay. I guess I introduced timestamps here, so that's helpful. Uh, is is YouTube gonna be this slow? Am I gonna have to go to the local files? Uh, I'm probably not gonna be streaming for too much longer because I do have stuff I wanted to do tonight. I just figured, oh, I have a, f a couple hours free. I could stream this because I've been meaning to work on this. Uh, whoop, 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 no, 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 scroll up. There we go. Okay, screw this. That's not. Oh, but uh, these files aren't in order. Uh... <laughs> uh... <laughs> Uh, it's gonna be really annoying when I'm editing too. And <laughs> motivational messages. Okay, when did I add mixer? Oh, did they get to Madam Brood before I added mixer? Oh, is my is my timeline out of whack? I thought I added mixers away for them to get up the hill. That video is just nothing. But was it actually for Madam Brood? Mixer come in. Okay. Yeah, Mixer chat does nothing for me. Okay, but yeah, Mixer chat did nothing for a little while. Yeah, that, that was like half an hour that Mixer chat did nothing. That did not take long to add. And then, yeah, very shortly after adding Mixer, well, relatively speaking, this is like still an hour or something. Uh, if you haven't seen YouTube Plays Odyssey, well, obviously I'll have a video about it pretty shortly. But, uh, I've got, uh, oh crap, I closed it. I've got, uh, the full archive on my YouTube channel. If you want to get a taste. Anyway, uh... And... On top of that... 
for however many good intentioned evil there were in the chat were also a handful of bad actors. You've been on the internet, right? Yeah, I, I, I don't know. It's maybe a weird thing to say. You've been on the internet, right? You know what trolls are. Maybe this is a uh, weird sentence, but whatever. If I decide I don't like it, I can always go back. That's why I'm writing a script. That's the whole point. I'm writing a script so I can go back. Oh, it took... Oh, you know what? I could do a, a, a kind of funny joke. I was about to say a really funny joke, but that's maybe selling it a bit too high. So well, it took only two hours to get through the... to, com to complete the entirety of the Cap Kingdom. Uh, 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 that's, that's not the structure I want that. Still though. After hours, they found their way to the top of the of the, uh, uh, what do you even call this? Cliff. Side. And hit the check point. Hit the check point. Hit the, you know, you, you can imagine what's happening right now, right? It, it's a clip of them not hitting the checkpoint. One of those that happened, right? That happened a few times, didn't it? Where they reached the top and then did not successfully hit the checkpoint. Yeah, I mean, you can you can see. Well, I guess you can't. I guess it took me a while. Yeah, you can see we have like chat log. Those chats turn into commands. There's a list of commands. Well, this isn't a very interesting camera angle, I guess. But you, you've seen Twitch Plays Pokemon, right? If you have not seen Twitch Plays Pokemon, I'm going to assume you've been living in a cave for the past few years, and you don't even know what a computer is. That, that was a dumb sentence. I don't know why I said that like that, but whatever. This is why I'm writing scripts. Because if I just let words flow from my mouth, then it becomes incoherent rambling before too long. Okay. But no, eventually they made it. And it only took two ways to look at these hours in total. And hey, if the first boss was so easy, Surely the second will be as well, right? Ugh, and I'm I'm making work for my future self here, but 
death compilation. Yeah, actually, yeah, I, that that question mark was a typo, but yeah, I don't, I don't know if I'm actually gonna have the patience for that. Uh, uh be right back. Hello, I'm back. I'm back on the stream. Ah, oh, yeah, fine. Death compilation. All right. Clearly, the latency is going to be an issue here. I mean, obviously, right? It was an action game. Unlike Pokemon, Mario is an action game. It requires uh, care in time, time. Uh, is care put into timing it requires care with regard to timing with regard to just feels like such a lazy way to join two words I can't think of anything else wonder if oh, that's Because uh, Google Drive has a mode where it just removes these page boundaries. I was wondering if Word had something comparable, but like this looks bad. So like I don't want to get rid of the margins. I just want to get rid of the page boundaries. Which I guess I could do manually. Actually, no, not that. Not to that extent. There, that's better. Care with regard to timing and be punishing if you go up. In the case of the, am I spelling that right, Madam Brood? Oh, it has an E. I thought it might. What part are you typing? This part. Maybe I could, like old things or something as I do them.
Actually, how? Yeah, that's like a third of the way through. Like, it's not a third of the way through the stream, but, you know, there's a lot of setup and stuff you have to do. This is, this is, I don't think this is going to be a super long video. I don't know. I guess some of those later parts could be lengthy. I'm also a little worried, like, it's going to end up becoming repetitive, where it's like, Oh, they were faced with this challenge. Then they overcame it. Then they were faced with this challenge. Then they overcame it. Uh, I guess I have, maybe <laughs> if I wanted to like cheat off someone else's homework, I could watch like a, a Twitch Plays Pokemon summary. Yeah, like this one. So our story begins in Pallet Town. Where our story begins in Pallet Town. The subtitles, so I don't have to listen to this. Yeah, they're not automatic subtitles. This is one of the coolest videos I ever had. And this video is 17 minutes long. Oh my God! I had, I had actually completely forgotten about all that, like Bird Jesus, Praise Helix pseudo-religious nonsense that came about with <laughs> Twitch Plays Pokemon. So hearing someone just casually talk about that like it's the most normal thing in the world, it's like... <laughs> kind of... Uh, a little strange. Anyway. In the case of the Madame Brood, which isn't a word, fight... Well, for those who aren't familiar, you have to capture her pet. Oh, it's like chain. Ugh, that's not nothing. Uh, it's like chain chompikins or something. Capture her pet chain, Chompikins. Then run away from her. Uh, I guess not that. Run away from her until she gets tired. Then continue pulling. Launch the chain jump back into her face. <laughs> Need to play switch settings. Uh, maybe not. The first part is pretty. Oh. And of course, you have to do it all three times. It's three times, right? Without dying. Die. I know how to spell. First steps, pretty easy even for YouTube just spamming the capture button no cap capture button means a, a different thing hat throw button eventually get you where you want but then you have to react pretty quickly Else, Madam Brood, eject, Brood, eject you 
forcibly eject you. Ugh, this is, that's a cheesy, that's a cheesy thing to say. Uh, that feels like something a stupid YouTuber would say, doesn't it? Eject you from her, uh, ad adorable. Oh, I, I hate myself for writing these words on this page. I don't, I don't like this one bit. Mm, I would not, I would never say that. I don't think, but what else? Uh, I don't, I don't, I really don't want to say bitch slap. That's, that's rude. That's a, that's rude language. I shouldn't use that in my video. But just saying slap seems kind of slap you out of her Doggo, I don't, I don't know. What do fix this? <laughs> that question mark was also a typo, but you know what? Keep it. Uh. I don't know. Okay, sure. Not only that, but you have to continually hold in one direction while also contending with the not so cooperative. Camera. Is YouTube's chat uh, live streaming streaming infrastructure really equipped to handle this sort of daunting task? Oh, hi Flex. Is Flex in the stream? No, it's not. Okay, good. No. No, it is not. That that's a pretty funny line, right? I can make of the joke. <clears throat> Ugh. How long has it been? An hour and a half. We've written 782 words. That's well, some of these words I had already, and some of them are very much not words. <laughs> Uh, but that, that's pretty good progress, honestly. Uh, I was planning on, uh, doing something tonight, but I'm waiting on some people to, uh, get back to me. Yes, this is live. That's why it says live in the title. You see? Live. It's because it's live. That's why it says live. No. No, it is not. Although I, I had started this project as something of a joke, after, I don't have, why did I keep closing that? After however many hours of watching a chat room full of people struggle against insurmountable odds, I found myself oddly invested in my own creation and wanting it to actually I guess not and wanting it to actually succeed is impossible as it seemed
boo, 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 boo. I'm gonna time you out. Cause you're being annoying. There's a bolt loose in my chair and it's annoying me. I don't know. I guess I do have an Allen key somewhere. Anime. Whoops, I didn't I said that out loud. I shouldn't have said that. I'm still I've gotten <laughs> this is gonna come back to bite me in the ass. Doing the stream has gotten me in the habit of speaking out loud everything I type. And while I'm also trying to hold private chats on the same stream, that's that is going to end poorly for me someday. If I keep doing this. Actually, see, it is impossible as it seemed. Uh, but for that, we were going to need a tool more powerful than just YouTube. Introducing. Mixer. Yeah, I guess there's a pause there, but that doesn't actually correlate to a comma. Introducing Mixer. Microsoft's underappreciated live streaming service. Its headlining feature. Sub. I want to say like sub second, but that's weirdly alliterative. Less than a second of latency. And a chat infrastructure. With this sort, this chat infrastructure actually designed with this sort of use case in mind. Maybe that's cheating. Maybe I'm ruining the p running. No, ruining the purity social experiment. You can make your own judgments. But regardless, YouTube. Oh God, I've got to type out and then say the whole thing. YouTube plays Super Mario Odyssey had evolved into YouTube plays. Super Mario Odyssey now with Mixer or Mixer plays Super Mario Odyssey. I, I added this later, but we'll just pretend now with YouTube. And, uh, quotation marks. I'm a programmer. I should be able to handle that. On your pers perspective, hey, I did it. Oof. 
and wouldn't know it. This their new found hours without combined forces of YouTube and Mixer dispatched I don't know if I want to keep using the word dispatched but because I, I feel like that's a word people never use but it's a fun word and I was gonna say conquered but that has implications Under an hour. Booyah. Which brings us to this part, which is like Tostarena and the Lake Kingdom, they just kind of went really well without any incident, which is like. On the one hand, you might want to like spend, you know, you kind of want to like talk about that because you know it's it's a success. You don't want to keep dwelling on all the failures, or like the, you know, I mean, yeah. Every time they take a while to do something, that's a series of failures followed by success. But it's like that's kind of the boring part. Like I'm sure it was satisfying or whatever to like do Toasterana and the Light Kingdom. For the people who are that, who, bleh, for the people who are actually playing, but I don't know if they're necessarily interesting to talk about for more than a sentence or two. Oh yeah, that's that's a good point. Trace walking. I kind of forgot about that. So yeah, I guess I'll have to walk work in trace walking because that was kind of hilarious. Uh, actually, yeah, I, I, I think I think that, I think I can uh, segue to that pretty nicely. They're able to like, con they're able to, you know, I'll just talk about how easy Toast Arena is and how confident everyone was, and like, I bet they can even do trace walking. No, no, they can't. You know, yeah, you have a nice, you can have some nice comedic timing there. Uh, where's where's Toast Arena? It did not take long. There we go. Oops. Come on, hit the A button. Someone hit the A button. There we go. I mean, they, they went in the correct direction at the start, but then <laughs> just immediately. And the fact that they kept jumping, it's not even something I considered doing at any point in trace walking, but sure enough, they accounted for it. <laughs> Is this loss? the circle that's kind of impressive they didn't stray too far this time oh <laughs> I think they might have I think they did it again and they just walked away <laughs> is that what this attempt is oh no great Come on, guys, give it another shot. I bet you can do it this time. 
wonder if this one will be funnier. <laughs> well, it, 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 mm, I don't know if it's going to result in as funny of a screenshot, but maybe in a video as I'm just walking away. It starts erasing <laughs> Zero! Great job. Okay. I have not heard back from the people I'm waiting on. Even though they've seen my message, I have the receipts. Are they read receipts or read receipts? I always said read receipts, but then I realized maybe read receipts makes more sense. If it's like a noun. Anyway. Uh, I wasn't planning on doing this for too long, but uh, I don't have anything better to do. Then to Toasterena. Spelled that right, right? Yes. Could have just Googled it, but I had to make sure it was on stream. Brings them to Toast Arena. Uh, for the. F yeah, I guess I can talk about it in a little more depth. For the first time ever presented with an iota. Of freedom. Up until this point, the game had. Yeah, I guess, I guess the longer I talk here, the longer I can like show clips of them being successful. Up until this point, the game had been more or less linear, forcing them... I, I'm using like them, which is kind of weird, but... I wonder if the, uh, the Twitch Plays Pokemon Summer used like we and us, whereas this is from my perspective, and like I, I very... Rarely actually interacted. And so for me, it's more like a them and a they, or a you. <laughs> if I tell this in the second person, that would be weird. That would definitely get uncomfortable. Uh, what's happening on the Discord? Forcing them to try to attempt, but no, not even trying, forcing them to conquer, forcing them to complete challenges that, given their, their own divide, given, given the choice, they choice, they would would rather just ignore. 
Once the game opened up, however, this move should be very much to their benefit. I feel really weird using the word there so much. There and they and them. But I guess it's, it's the grammatically correct word to use in this context. This proves to be very much to their benefit. Although there would be disagreement at times about which moon to pursue. Pursue? Peruse? Per oh. Pfft. I can spell the participants. That's wordy, though. Oh, it's newfound one word. Oh, it's high. Thanks. Uh, is this stream actually 4K? It's only showing 1440p for me. Which I'm, I'm sure is good enough since I've got the text so big, but I'm pretty sure I'm streaming out at 4K. But YouTube's only showing 1440. Maybe I read this thing wrong. I am streaming at 4K, right? Yeah, it should be. Maybe, uh... Yeah, I don't know why YouTube's not showing a 4K option. It's only showing up to 1440. It's only showing 1440p for me. Anyway, that's unimportant. I'm sure no one here is wanting to watch this in 4K regardless. Uh, it'd be neat to know that I could stream at 4K. Disagreement at times about which moon to pursue. Uh, the freedom. We go after easy targets. Uh, combined with the newfound coordination. Oh, <laughs> new. Also, oh, wait, new, newfound is one word? Whatever, I don't want it to be. Uh, but I don't also, I just don't want to. The coordination that Mixer allowed. That Mixer provided. made them an unstoppable force. Uh, I don't, I don't know, that's a bad phrasing, but whatever. They're discriminant at times, yeah, sure. Typos are not my priority at the moment. It's not like I'm submitting this to a professor. Uh... In fact, they were so confident in their abilities that they even tried to tackle, trackle, <laughs> tackle the uh, Koopa Trace Walking Challenge. I don't know if any of those words should be capitalized. It went as expected. <laughs> Step in your own language.
Even so, they plowed through not only Toast Arena, but the Lake Kingdom. I'm switching between like the name of the town and the name of the kingdom, but I don't think any. I think that I think that's that's just like what people refer to them as, right? Like it's technically the Sand Kingdom and the Lake Kingdom, or Toast Arena and Lake whatever. Uh, I'll probably just show like a clip of the employees only moon while I'm talking about coordination in the uh, general sense. And I'll just show like a montage of them collecting moons or something. I don't want to like sp spend too much time on like any one thing, you know? When I can just like show things in the background. Like Talking about other things and uh, yeah. Yeah, it seems like a long video. Well, we're up to a thousand words, and the volleyball video was two thousand words, so. But I also talked really slowly in this video as everyone, literally everyone on the planet pointed out. So I feel like I maybe I maybe could have talked like twice as fast. <laughs> Just make the video six hours long. Good idea. I maybe could have... There was a part in the Luncheon Kingdom where we recorded something pretty nicely. I don't remember what that was. You're going to mention the Discord? Nah. I'll link it in the uh, video description, though. It's like, if I talk twice as fast as in this video, which I theoretically could... Like, I usually talk too fast when I'm... Like, when I'm giving a... Especially in school. Oh, am I, uh... uh... Okay... Like, when I'm... When I'm giving a presentation in school, you know, it's like, you have however many people that have to go in a class period, and it's like, okay, I have... 60 slides to get through, or like 50. Wait, is, was this an actual slide? Yeah, it was. Great. <laughs> this was actually in my presentation. I did not remember that. <laughs> yeah, like you're, you're, so I'd find myself like just talking as quickly as possible, which I was pretty good at. But, uh, so, like, when I was making the... There were a number of reasons in the volleyball video why I was talking so slowly. And one of them was that I was deliberately trying to talk slower to counteract my, like, usual habit of talking too quickly. But I guess I went a bit too far with it. So, it's definitely feasible that I uh, talk faster. Anyway. So yeah, I don't know how long this video is going to be. Hopefully not longer than 20 minutes. Like that, that feels like an upper limit on length for a YouTube video that people would actually want to watch. I feel like that number, though, of, like, how long of a YouTube video are people willing to watch, that number is, like, trended upwards. So I feel like once upon a time it was like, oh, you can't make your videos longer than three minutes or no one will watch them. And, like, once upon a time the YouTube time limit was 11 minutes for all videos. And so you'd, like, have to edit down L Let's Play segments. 
to fit within that time restraint. Let's see, the, the jump rope video was 14 minutes, and the volleyball video was 17 and a half. And, you know, pe people watched those. Make it, no, no one watches two-part videos, I don't think. Two-part videos are a mistake. I mean, unless it can double my ad revenue. I mean, if if you want to go down that route, then yeah, let's game the system. Sure, hell yeah, why not? But, <laughs> I don't know if that's wise. I mean, maybe it is. I don't know. I'm, I'm not exactly a professional YouTuber. I mean, technically speaking. Uh, you sound like a professor who just got high. Why is literally every comment about that? Like, I mean, I know it's YouTube comments and they're bad, but ugh. Yeah, like, there are some people who get away with longer videos, but even someone like, uh... Oh, what's he called? Three Blue, One Brown. Like... He makes, like, 20-minute videos. Like, 20 to 30-minute videos. And those feel, like, really long for a YouTube video. And, I mean, people watch them, obviously. His videos all get hundreds of thousands, if not millions, of views. But they just feel absurdly long for, uh, for a YouTube video. And, like, I, I personally have no problem with long videos, but I know a lot of people do. Slowing down and speeding up your voice, it, I mean, it works pretty well, especially if you have something like Audition that's pretty good at it. But it, it's still not perfectly natural. Like, Hi, this is me talking at a normal rate into a microphone and then recording myself using this software. Let's, let's turn that up so you can maybe actually hear it. Hi, this is me talking at a normal rate into a microphone and then recording myself using this software. So then if we like... Fast talker, isotype radius, precision high, stretch 45%, vocoder precise, boom. That's like the highest quality possible, short of... Yeah, no, that, this is like as high quality as you can possibly get for like speeding up a voice. Hi, this is me talking at a normal rate into a microphone okay, and then recording it, myself using the software to a... Maybe that was a little too fast, actually. Uh, but let's do something reasonable, like say 80%. That's 65, whatever, close enough. Just like make myself faster. Hi, this is me talking at a normal rate into a microphone and then recording myself using the software. And like there, there's, it's, yeah. It doesn't sound as good for a variety of reasons. It's, it's not worth, it's not worth relying on that. Like maybe you can speed yourself up like 5% or something if you really have to, but you know, if you're doing something that's really timing dependent, then, you know, maybe you can fudge it a little bit, but I don't know if you'll want to rely on that. I mean, you know, there are some people who make it part of their gimmick, like, uh, extra credits. They obviously speed up their, he speeds up his voice and pitches it up, but that's, you know, part of their aesthetic at this point. Ugh. Not really something you want to rely on, unless you're like going for that effect. Even so, they plowed through not only Toast Arena, but the Lake Kingdom in record time.
Oh, yeah, then we want to talk about the deep words and the challenges that present. I don't, I don't know if I even want to really spend that much time on the deep words, because it was just an annoyance, you know? Uh, not, not so much, like, something to overcome. Ugh. Uh, it's been, like, two hours, right? That's about how long I wanted to work on this for, but... Uh, my friends are busy. I don't have anything else to do. But I don't really know. I guess that it doesn't have to be its own paragraph. Yeah, I guess I have a nice contrast here. It's like, oh, what's it even called? The Wooded Kingdom. I guess this would be a good place for a, a however. I, I, I feel like I need to be conscious of my use of the word however, because when I'm writing a paper, however is that word that likes to uh, sneak its way in everywhere. But, you know, it's not a supernatural word. The Wooded Kingdom, however, was not so forgiving. Uh, see, most of the time, assist mode is a vital tool. See, for... Uh, see, for most of... For, see, okay. Up until now, assist mode had been. Well, a tense is weird. I hate tense. I don't know if I've ever mentioned that, but I hate tense and thinking about tense. See, up until now, assist mode had been up, up. Because, like, I'm talking in the present tense there, but then in the past tense there. And it's like, I think that's how I would talk. That's how I would construct that sentence if I were saying it out loud, but then writing it down and just, like, seeing that contrast there. Like, I don't know if it's... I don't care if it's grammatically correct or whatever, but just, like, seeing it staring you in the face like that, it just makes you realize, eh, I don't know if I'm, if I'm doing the right thing here. So up until now, up, I guess I could say up until this point... But then, mm, which brings, that's, that's present, <laughs> yeah, the present tense. <sighs> See, up until it had been an indispensable? Well, for one thing, it's not, still not how you spell that, indispensable, oh, it's a little tool, is that, uh, like invaluable, yeah, I guess invaluable fits better than invaluable, tool, assist, <laughs> Right, I, I need to stop thinking in terms of actual sentences. Like, if I was saying this out loud, I would say, like, see, up until this point, assist mode had been an invaluable tool, period. Or m dash. You can call, like, if, if I were writing a paper, I would want to make this, like, a long sentence with, like, multiple clauses and commas and shit. But if I'm, if I'm, people don't talk like that, you know, like, yeah, I want to. I, 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 even if you're like writing, if you you, you <laughs> this is why I don't this mm, mm, this is why they don't let me ramble. If I ramble, things go off the rails very quickly. <laughs> and this is why I'm writing a script. Except then writing a script gets me out of that mindset of just talking naturally. And like I if if I just write words on a page, I I I think I can put together something 
relatively coherent and you know maybe maybe poetic is too lofty of a word but you know something that flows naturally something that has rhythm to it you know you need like a good mix of like short sentences and big long flowery sentences but i feel like when i when i get into this mode of like writing a paper it's like oh every sentence has to be this big long construct constructed thing when it's like no that's not it's been it's been too long you know like i've been out of school for nearly a year and i mean senior year it's not i was barely i was barely there <laughs> to be to be honest it's been too long since i've had to like do this sort of thing but like this ah. i like making presentations and like writing natural like i hate writing papers and this makes me feel like i'm writing a paper when actually what I'm doing is this sort of thing. Well, not, not this sort of thing. But I, I am writing a presentation. I am writing something that is meant to be spoken aloud and is meant to sound natural and is meant to entertain. And those are two similar yet also very different things. And I'm, I'm decent enough at both of them. Like, you know, I, I passed English class. I can write a paper. But I, I don't like to. I like to do this sort of thing, and it's hard to get back into this mindset, I think. What? Whatever. I'm rambling. I could show you my presentation on Persona, too. That was a... That was a... That was another instance of, uh... Let's see, where is it? Right here. This was another instance where I put all of my effort into the presentation first. upon a time and well yeah <laughs> yeah I was like 2008 PS2 game and yeah it's, and yeah I use lots of videos and stuff anyway with the rest of this presentation not this interesting oh I, if you weren't here earlier this was for my game design class which is why I was making presentations about video games but uh <laughs> actually uh, while, while we're in the middle of story time, uh, I don't know where I put this. Uh, in here. 204 presentation. Yeah. <laughs> uh, when I was in Japan taking Japanese classes, we had to make a presentation about something from Japanese culture we're interested in. And so I just always just plagiarized myself and just used the exact same presentation template and everything. I had actually forgotten how. <laughs> yeah, that was fun. Anyway. Ah, what was I saying? Right, you can call it cheating, but let's be real here. Got ahead of myself. This challenge would be impossible without it. Uh, bathroom break.
Okay, I'm back now. I left for five minutes. How did we get to Persona? Uh, right, right, because I was talking about how... I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how we got to Persona. Uh, but I, I was... At, I'm actually being productive. Look at that. Well, you, could, you probably cannot read that. But 1,000 words, 1,100 words. At least it's better than 1,100 pages like that Google Doc. Uh, what was I saying? Let's be real, this challenge would be impossible. Normally, when you fall off a ledge, assist mode is ever so kind. Yeah, when, you don't end up like writing fun things like that. Like You would never write that in a paper, but that's totally something I would say. And I definitely want to have that kind of thing in here. Yeah, it's this format that's screwing me up. Just the fact that I'm writing this in Word and it's doing like grammar checking and stuff for me. It's it's getting me in the wrong mindset. Maybe I should just do this in PowerPoint. Uh, but it's not like I can make the whole video in PowerPoint. That wouldn't really work out. Uh, did I miss anything? Oh, that's right, you couldn't hear me over the music, I forgot. I turned that way up. Oh, well, too late now. Uh, Sys mode is ever so kind as to direct, as to lovingly deposit you. Yeah, I, I, want, I want to throw in some fun, fun words. It's ever so kind as to, oh, whoops. As to lovingly deposit you. I want to make sure it's actually legible. Lovingly deposit you back onto the platform from which you came. The Wooded Kingdom has different ideas. Has a no, it has different ideas about what to do with you. Whoops, I said a question. Diff oh. <laughs> Try to type a paragraph with you, you guys. No, I, I would. But the problem is you guys can add images, and all it takes is one person to add something unsavory. And then, you know, don't want that to happen. Ah, does this flow? The Wooded Kingdom, however, was not so forgiving. See, up until this point, assist mode had been an invaluable tool. You can call it cheating, but let's be real here. This challenge would be impossible without it. Normally, when you fall off a ledge, assist mode is ever so kind as to lovingly deposit you back onto the platform. Back upon... Like, maybe that's not great grammar, but whatever. Assist mode is ever so kind as to lovingly deposit you back upon the pl No. Back... Back onto... Assist mode is ever so kind as to lovingly deposit you back onto the platform from which you came. From whence you came? Is that a word? From... From whence it came. Whence, according to conventional definitions, from where? From whence is logically de redundant. Okay, yeah, whence is a word. From whence you came.
Okay, let's, let's read this again. Normally, when you fall off a ledge, assist mode is ever so kind as to lovingly deposit you back onto the platform from whence you came. The Wooded Kingdom has different ideas about what to do with you. The Wooded Kingdom... See, so normally you wouldn't want to repeat yourself, but if you're speaking, that's a totally natural thing to do there. If this were a paper, you wouldn't want to say the Wooded Kingdom twice. But since it's a presentation, and I have to get myself in that presentation mindset, uh, th this is the hardest part about it for me, I think, is that I'm just not in the right mindset. Which I guess is, I guess I need to, like, talk, talking, talking, words, words, words. I've never done this before, aside from the two times that I previously had. Ugh, I'm repeating myself. I'm repeating myself. I'm repeating myself. Now I'm doing annoying voices, and that's not helping anyone. The Wooded Kingdom thinks. Yeah, you know, see, I want to. I want to try to like personify the Wooded Kingdom here as like a malicious entity of sorts, but that takes thought and effort. The Wooded Kingdom thinks it would be in your best interests. If, when you happen to fall off a ledge, I, I ought to use, right, that's why I keep using they, because I can't say YouTube anymore, because now it's YouTube and Mixer, which is just too wordy. Well, it's not assist mode's fault. Assist mode isn't what's trapping them in the deep woods. They'd be just as trapped with or without assist mode. Well, I guess they could kill themselves more easily without assist mode, but... Actually, no. If you die in the deep woods, don't you just end up back in the deep woods? I thought that was part of the problem. I don't remember now. When was the last time you used want to do? If he misses multiple jumps in a row, as YouTube is want to do. I guess I could do that again. As the combined forces of... As the brilliant minds... You know... <laughs> whoops, brilliant, brilliant. <laughs> Brilliant minds of YouTube and Mixer I want to do. I just like the phrase want to do. If I'm being honest here. Yeah, assist mode is useless in the deep woods, but it's not actively malicious or whatever. Do I have any more fun presentations? I like looking back at my old presentations. <laughs> Whoops, wrong button. I don't know if anyone else cares about my old presentations, but I enjoy them. And that's what matters. UPTX. List of good video games on UPTX. Pray tell, what is in list of video? <laughs> list of good video games. Super Mario Brothers. That's... That is as far as I got in this presentation. <laughs> this, I could say stream, I could say chat. Even though it's technically two chats. Yeah, I, I guess, I, I, when I, well. Ah, <laughs> oh, here, here, story time. I'm gonna be right back. find the original version of this presentation. Yeah. So 
So, so yeah, uh, right. So I don't know if you've ever heard of like, uh, what's it called? What's it called? It's like PowerPoint karaoke or something like that. Karaoke sounds vaguely right. It's like something like that. Uh, but uh, basically the idea is you make a presentation and then you give it to someone else to present with like no preparation whatsoever. So uh, my friend did that for me and he, he made this. It's 30 pages of the Yi dinosaur. Yi, 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 A, Yi, 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 Yi. It continues in that pattern. Um, and I happen to really enjoy that presentation. So, uh, let's see if this is going to work. Ah, crap. This is going to work. Oh, friggity freckle. Can I just, like... Uh, I mean, yeah, it is, but it's not working. Come on. Oh, oh, it worked. Ha! Uh, I like that presentation so much that I had it made. No, oh, it's backwards. Uh, how do I fix that? There, I had it made into a book. 20 pages. I had to remove 10 pages to save money. But 20 pages of the Yi dinosaur. Yi. Yi. It's hard to hold a book like this. Yi. Help me. Ye. Yeah, skip the page. Kill him. They're holding me hostage. Ye. 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 I, I really like that that page. There is no twentieth dinosaur. I lied. Now spit at the book in retaliation. Anyway, uh, how long is the stream going for? I just got a message. Maybe it's someone telling me. Okay, yeah. Uh, my friends are going to be over soon, so <laughs> maybe I'll leave the stream running until they get here. I don't think they know I'm running a stream, and they can uh, find themselves injected into the middle of a stream. I might get bored of this before then, though. I don't know how long they're going to be. It is a very good book, though. Uh, Amazon was holding a promotion for, like, custom-printed books. So it was, like, $5 or something. Uh, definitely worth every penny. Wait. Oh, you have school for four more hours. I was about to say. Don't know what time zone you're in there, but you have to go to school in four hours. You should probably be asleep. 
<laughs> leave the stream going until after they leave. Yeah, I'm sure they'd be thrilled. Uh, then you'd learn about all the degenerate anime we're watching. <laughs> Got an exciting night planned. I want to do... You were sent... To the deed. <clears throat> to the deep words. No, I, hold on. To the deep words. Word. No, I, I can't. I forgot. I forgot how I did. Yeah, bo <laughs> Boku no Pico. Definitely haven't seen that one. <clears throat> Moving right along. You have school in three hours. I hope you slept at some point. <laughs> I came up halfway through typing the word deep. How lazy am I? Deep words. I can't do the voice. I'm going to have to learn how to do the voice again once I do the uh, audio. Ugh. So I can do more ASMR streams. <laughs> you were sent to the deep words. Uh, anime is gay. I mean, you're not wrong there. Ah, whatever. It's it's been two and a half hours. Uh, we've written nearly twelve hundred words. I don't really know how to finish this paragraph here. So I think I'm gonna call it here. Uh, maybe I'll try and find one more fun presentation for you. I don't know how many I have, but uh. Let's see what we got. I have a nice presentation on apples. Uh, oh, yeah, I gave one on Gone Home. On Flux. Eh, actually, I don't know if I have many others. A lot of these are from, like, high school. And, like, <laughs> yeah. Pico x Chico. That's... That's definitely, definitely Oh, that's definitely not something we would want to watch. Anyway here, uh, I can't find anything else, so let's I think I will probably turn off this stream, but I will probably be back sometime this week, uh, and I will continue working on this thing. Uh, I don't want these archives to clutter up my YouTube channel, so it's the archive of this is going to be unlisted. Uh, I will, however, post it on my Twitter and my, oh, not my, on the Discord. So if you find yourself wanting to, uh, relive this, join the Discord, follow me on Twitter, uh, it'll be worth your while. I post only the best tweets. And I like to see the numbers go up, so, you know. Uh, that is all I've got, I think, for the time being. Hopefully both of those links work. Because I know YouTube chat likes to eat links for breakfast. Hopefully those both work. Uh, they appear to. So, yeah.
Uh, I, I would like to make a video about this, the YouTube Plays thing, because uh, I feel like maybe not enough people got to actually, like, experience it. And, you know, even the people who did, you know, I was, you know, I was waiting for my job to start at that time. So I, I had no school, no work, nothing to do. I was spending 16 hours a day watching that live stream. Uh, I feel like maybe most, the overwhelming majority of people did not get that experience. And so I think this video would be, uh, you know, valuable in that regard. I might also want to make, like, a sort of unabridged highlights video. That's something I've been thinking about as well. It's like, this will be the nice narrated, sort of polished thing, but then also just, like, you know, cut out all the deaths, show all the successes, that sort of thing. Make it, like, a two-hour video or something like that. Uh, I, that's not a priority, though. This, right now, is my priority in terms of YouTube. Uh, and I, I've also got that other idea for a stream I wanted to do. I don't, I don't know if I'm gonna end up doing that. At least not anytime soon. Probably not until I make this video. And apparently, I've got to get my hands on a copy of Adobe Premiere because I apparently no longer own it, even though I thought I did. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, this cannot continue. Uh, do I? Oh, yeah, I do have that soundtrack open. Uh, see you next time.